I'm arrested. I'm locked inside your love. I need leverage. And if you give me some, then I will stir. I'll be right where you want me. I wouldn't mind if you love me forever. I wanna stay in the same place. Well, hey guys, it's Chandler Alexis. <laughs> Welcome back to my channel. Welcome to my channel. If you're new here, this is my vlog channel. Tori sleeping. <laughs> is looking very wild right now. I need a hat. But I don't see any hats in here. By the way, I just realized there's a light switch in this closet. And I've been here for a while. Like six, seven months. Didn't even know that. I haven't been here that long. Maybe like four months. But I didn't know that there was a light switch in here. Okay, I need a hat. I'm not seeing one in here sometimes they fall on the ground but i don't see any okay we're just gonna have to make do with the headband for today maybe this pink one sorry guys i'm whispering because i don't want to wake tori up pink one might be cute let's try it we'll let me turn the light off Okay, now that I'm in my room, I can talk loud and clear, but today is sa Sunday. Ooh, today is Sunday. It's a nice Sunday too, as you guys can see, the sun is out. My hair is looking really fucked up, but I need to film a video later today, so I'm keeping it in only for that sake. But after I'm done with that video, I am taking my hair out. I really wanted a hat. I just don't think this is the look. Okay, we're not going with gray. Okay, this might be cute for today. Let me know what you guys think. I'm not going out, so it's fine. It's really just to have my hair out of my face while we write. Um, oh yeah, I didn't mention that. I think, or did I? I'm about to have a writing session right now um, with the same girl who wrote with me the other day. Um, by the way, guys, I would mention her name but I have actually noticed something I'm not going to really talk much about in this video. But there's a certain person who has been going around basically trying to sabotage everything that I do. Like by getting certain people to like not talk to me or get people to unfollow me or stuff like that. And like I just don't want to be involved in anyone's negativity. And I'm not the type of person to ever try and get in the way of anyone's success. Um but i guess not everyone is like that and there are people out there who are going to hate on you and who are going to want to bring you down because you are no longer a benefit to their life and you know that's how the world is i i know that and i have to accept that but with that being said i'm going to now start keeping the, more of like the projects that i work on more confident more confident more private to me and the people that I'm working with until after it's done so best believe after this project that I'm working on right now is done with I will definitely be giving major props to the girl who does the writing sessions with me because she is amazing she has her own music as well that I really want you guys to listen to but as for right now I'm just gonna keep it to myself because I don't want people or that certain person trying to get in the way of that at all because I'm really happy right now and I'm really having fun with what I'm doing and I'm enjoying myself and like that's all life is about like for me at least I just want to enjoy myself have a good time I'm not here to burst anyone's bubble or be rude to anyone or talk down on anyone or, or spread negativity at all that's not the person I am I understand sometimes that is where I have to go because that's what people bring into my life but once you are out of my life I would just appreciate that you do your own thing and you worry about yourself because you don't have to worry about me. I'm doing fine. Um, you know, don't have to check up on me. You don't have to tell people that they can't talk to me because I'm not an evil person. Like, <laughs> it's just not that serious. It's not that deep. You get me? But, um, yeah, so I have a writing sesh. She's actually should be here in, like, a few minutes. And then after that, I need to film some videos for my channel. 
and then later tonight we might do something i don't know i think tori's kind of tired like i said she's out there sleeping so yeah i definitely do want to take this hair out of my hair though i wish it had lasted longer but i think i need to like have someone teach me how to maintain my hair first before <laughs> i like commit to this um because my actual like it's not the hair itself that that the um, the weave itself is in great condition it's my hair on top that like let me show you guys right here obviously you can see my hair on top is just fried and i'm not trying to damage my natural hair and um it just feels disgusting it has hairspray in it and products in it it's just not cute so i just really want to take this hair out and move on with my life <laughs> obviously that was an over exaggeration but you guys get what i'm saying so yeah anyways i hope you guys enjoyed today's vlog that was a pretty long intro <laughs> but uh yeah if you do make sure you have a like comment down below subscribe to my channel do all that cool stuff turn my notifications on as well as to be notified every time i upload and also wait stop pause drop roll is that what it is <laughs> stop dropping the roll guys follow me on snapchat because lately i've been posting all my like little juicy videos on snapchat i don't really post them on instagram anymore because it just doesn't look good for like brands and stuff but all my little juicy snapchats are or all my little juicy videos are on my snapchat it's chandler lexus g um and also i post like songs on there that i'm listening to at the moment so a lot of you like my playlist and always i see always in the comments it's like what song is that what song is that definitely follow me on snapchat to find out what songs i'm listening to at the current moment but yeah anyways i'll see you guys in a second and then i was thinking you said the oh i get it oh my gosh that took me a minute <laughs> talk to 12 is a jury no 12 is a cop <laughs> oh <laughs> What? <laughs> Wait, let me see it. I thought 12 was a jury because you know a jury is like 12 people so like you wouldn't snitch on him in court. I've never thought about it like that. That's actually... See? No, but in America we call the police 12. But won't talk to the police. Like because if you commit the crime, I won't talk to the police. And if I do, I'll lie for you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, I, guess it, I guess to use your kind of line it could be like... Won't talk to 12, but did I would lie? Da -da -da -na 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 -na. Maybe let's take out that 12, the 12 one. So I see... Mm, I want to say something about your mind, like. Mm. Okay, yeah, that would that would fit better, actually. Yeah, yeah. I suppose it could change. It it could always change though. Like it doesn't really have to be like, um, like one idea the whole pre course. Yeah, yeah, you could yeah, always yeah. have two. Like. It change it. So you could keep the one talk to twelve. Okay. If I did, I would lie. But then make, you have to make the line after that makes sense with that line. Should we just repeat the 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 bit in the in the verse again? Which part? We'll just do. Canning me up whenever you want. Is that just being lazy? <laughs> Let's try. How does it sound? Let's see. But what else can we say instead of baby? It's so like I know like you just like <laughs> alternate between like boy baby let's, and let's like. Let's be dappy and say uh, what did he say? Dumpling. <laughs> you know that song where he says dumpling. <laughs> or even if we switched and said, I'm not trying to fuck. I want to make love. Mhm. Mm then what it rhyme? Let me see. Either way, either saying I'm down for your love, or we can just fuck. Then I'm not something, something grab it. If you say I'm trying to fuck, I'm mm -hmm. down for your love. Is that more okay. savage? Like just being um, wrong about it. I think they're both equally savage. Okay. What was the other one that you said? Um, the second one. Um, we can make love or we can just fuck mm -hmm. um it was like i think 12 cop cars involved not even just that if i'm you, giving him his address that's what i'm saying if everything. you put me in that situation that's not love oh, what the fuck that, that's yeah. evil you want me to go to hell as well mm -hmm. absolutely not we're taking a quick break to take this weave out my head. <laughs> I just can't do it anymore, guys. It feels like I'm wearing a beanie that I can't take off. It's itchy as fucking it. Yeah, it's itchy. But it's like, at this point, I don't mind the itchy if it was, like, looking cute, you know? But it's looking a mess. And so it's like, I just want it <laughs> out. <laughs> I look like a one of those Barbie dolls that you haven't brushed their hair in a while. <laughs> <laughs> oh. My. Shit. <laughs> no, show the top, that's the worst part. And you've got a little conk in your head as well because of where she tucked the hair on. <laughs> it's tucked Wait. in under. Does it come out? Wait, move your hand quick. Who <laughs> just have to cut the like, See the little cup? <laughs> <laughs> Wait, how did you should just walk the hand and go like that. <laughs> what did it? I don't want to be rude and say it. Okay, let me know. <laughs> what are you about to say? Imagine y'all just left and I'm like here, like just can't figure out how to take the braids out. So I'm just like, stuck, stuck like this. Yeah, I think I've got to cut the thread. Four days, five days, maybe six. 
Done. I just can't. Wait, not even that long. I got it done on Tuesday. <laughs> She's too cute. Hi, yes. Besitos. Da besitos. Thank you. Okay, we finished the song. Do you want to hear it? Yeah. <clears throat> All right, got you. This boy that's like he's like posing with this big bag of basmati rice. <laughs> and that's the thing. He's just like like he stole it. He's he stole like, it, right? He stole the rice. <laughs> but he's actually smart though because his mom ate well. Like, he got it. <laughs> they had rice every day for yeah, dinner. Like, this boy was upset. Like, so steal a TV on or a laptop, sell it, and buy basmati rice. <laughs> <laughs> Really high. I would have never thought about it. I would have like, I want Cheetos. I want this. No, me and Bray would have thought it so like, I don't know, like clothes. To be fair, I like my life, I would have passed up a stone. Anything? No, no. I would have value up. Value up. Like, I would have to be in the bag. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, cool. Scooters. But if you register the car, they were never stolen, so then you were insurance that everything is valid. They've got like ten thousand dollars in the money. Go buy yourself a new car. No, I can't do that. I don't think you can actually sell a car. You listen, you can't because you need a logbook and everything for it. The logbook would be with them. Sell it to someone on the black market. They're not gonna care. I mean, I would sell all the AirPods at the Apple Store. They weren't even there at the time, though. But I guess if it was now. Oh yeah. Well, not taking yeah. MacBooks. You know what? all the phones and shit. Not, of shit. You know they'll check it back by the IMEI number and then they'll block yeah. the whole system. That's why we're selling them though. We're not using you it. You got on this one. You got pockets for the buy a blocked phone or a blocked yeah, iPad. Yeah, they bought it. They Apple they can't do nothing about it. No, it's like, apparently, oh, it's I, not, like it's, you actually no, but you can't when, get when into it. But then when they say it, like when you say you can't, it says I like it. Just you can't get into it. It's like no, they can't. This is why Apple are fucking smart. Listen, you can't check it back. Well, no, you can track it back by the IMEI number, but say for example now, obviously it's come a problem, the phone's blocked, they go to Apple, it's a problem, who the fuck did you buy it from, they come back to you, you're done. Yeah, you can't go to Apple, you're done. Like, the way that this fucking government works over here in England, I'm and still about on America, a plane. <laughs> that's what I want to stole. I would have stole a plane. <clears throat> Wait, what do I look like as a guy now? Very sexy. Ooh, I got a man bun. Thank you. Look at that. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. You want to get this picture of me. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, this filter is really scary. Mm -hmm. Very. Especially because it's not making us all look like the same person. So that means that it adjusts to your features. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Cool. Cool. That is scary. All right, cool. I'm cutting. Okay, I'm going to leave as well. <laughs> Everybody's cheap. Everybody's cheap. Everybody's cheap. Wait, honey, you're coming back, right? I'm coming, but also I've got a little surprise there. Because now I've got a kitten. Oh, you're gonna bring your little kitten? Oh, okay. that is so cute. I have to. Okay, okay. I have to. Hopefully, I'm not allergic to it. All right, guys. So now that my friends are gone, oh my god, there's literally stuff. We took out my weave, and tell me why we took it out. And then my cousin was like, "Oh, you could have just washed your hair and the weave. I didn't know you could wash weave." <laughs> I could have just washed my hair guys because the reason I was getting upset is because my natural hair was becoming stiff and disgusting and I needed to wash that I didn't know I could wash the weave so that's why I was like oh, I have to take out the weave in order to wash my hair so we just took out the weave so fail fail on my behalf and you know what? I'm gonna take this out and I'm gonna move on with my life it's okay but anyways um I got a package today so we're gonna open it quickly obviously Instagram pics coming soon with these items so check out my Instagram but let's just see what we got package time this package is from Femme Lux so first I picked these items out by the way so first I got these leggings that are like the leather leggings oh I thought these would be more like jeans like with pockets and stuff I didn't realize they were actually like leggings I actually have a pair of these back in Cali but I mean cool now I have a second pair for here these are cute. Our pants too. Oh, these are. Oh, I have these ones in LA too. But I, why did I do this to myself? I don't think I actually thought this through. These are like these black. Um, yeah, you see the material. I don't know the name of this. What is this material called? Vinyl, 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 vinyl material. They're really. Hopefully, these ones aren't hard to put on. Cause my other ones are hard to put on. No, these will be easy to put on. But they just look like this. This will be really interesting to be wearing in London. Um, so yeah, I guess I just ordered two of the same things that I already actually think I think I think the ones that I have back in Cali are from Femlux as well, too So I'm dumb on my behalf then up next I ordered this top Which I have one similar to it, but this is just a one-sided 
crop top that's red i have one that is has both straps that's red but i didn't have one with one strap so i was like i like this one so i'm gonna get this one so this is really cute and then lastly i just got this set that comes together so it has like these black gaucho pants if you guys know what gauchos are like you're you're lit but they're just like those pants that make your butt look really good and they like flow at the bottom and then it comes with a matching top and this is a top that ties in the front let me see there you guys can see it um wraps around you and then it ties like in the front here and i actually had a shirt like this from pretty little thing but it didn't tie correctly and my titties were hanging out so let's hope this one fits correctly but yeah that's my little haul now i am about to edit a little bit we finished the song by the way it turned out really really good i can't wait for you guys to hear it um stay tuned on the updates on that i obviously have to hit studio now to start recording but this is the first song that i will actually say i'm really happy with it like i'm not second guessing it it doesn't sound cheesy at all it doesn't sound like it's not me like this song sounds like me like this is the kind of music i wanted to make in the first place but i could never like get that point across to people i was working with with music or like i didn't know how to say it like i didn't know how to tell them like what i would i didn't know how to i didn't know what kind of music it was that i wanted to make like the name of it and how to communicate that like i would always say oh kind of like this or kind of like that but i guess people don't really understand it but the songwriter that i'm working with now she was able to communicate with me and you know figure it out with what i wanted and we got exactly that done so that was great guys so it's the next day and the clips you saw before were me having a phone call a business call with someone who wants to manage my music so yeah that's dope um right now it's currently six almost seven o'clock today i didn't really do anything but just lounge around the house it's kind of my chill day today listening to some music right now i'm about to make me something to eat but yeah, I'm not really sure what I'm doing tonight. Um, someone is supposed to be coming over. But we'll see. Obviously, as you guys can tell, it is now nighttime. <laughs> so you thought it's actually morning. It is 4.30 in the morning. I have not gone to sleep yet. I'm exhausted. But I realized that with taking on new projects, I'm going to have to, you know stay up late and work on them for them to be as good as i want them to be so i've literally just been up all night working 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 um i'm excited to say that i will be going into the studio later tonight technically but for you guys it'll be in tomorrow's vlog but um i'm super excited about that all my friends are gonna be there so it's gonna be a cool vibe um also have plans in the daytime tomorrow well, evening time tomorrow as well but yeah i'm super excited about this music thing the fact that you know there's someone who wants to manage me in music and is actually like taking me serious is insane to me <laughs> like um i didn't reach out to him he reached out to me and he manages actually another huge artist in the uk i'm not going to mention who because like we said in yesterday's vlog or was that today's vlog i don't want people trying to ruin the stuff i got going on so i'm keeping it to myself but i'm actually really excited about that and i'm really excited to be dropping my first song very very soon for you guys literally everyone that's listened to it has been like that is a good ass song so i don't want to hype it up too much but just know i'm actually really proud of myself and i'm really excited for you guys to see this so just know you can honestly do whatever you put your mind to and anything is possible because had you told 2012 chandler that i'd be singing a song whoo i would not have believed you but it's happening and I'm super excited about it and I hope you guys are ready to start this new journey with me because I definitely want to start being 
taken serious when it comes to these projects I'm working on. Um, as you guys know, I've done modeling now, I've done acting now, and now I'm getting into music. And honestly, my I've never really had like one specific goal in life. I've always just wanted to do as much as I could, you know? I want to make sure that by the time I'm 80 years old, 90 years old, that I feel like I've done a lot, you know, and experienced a lot, which is one of the reasons I moved to London, you know? To be able to say that I've done these things. And so I just really need you guys to support and I really appreciate your support and every single one of you that leaves nice comments on my pictures every day, likes my pictures every day, or watches my Snapchat story or my Instagram story or DMs me, like just know I see you guys and I'm trying my hardest to respond to more of you guys on Snapchat. There's so many of you, but if I don't see your message, just send it again. I'm trying to respond to a lot of you guys on Snapchat. If you don't have me on Snapchat, if you don't have me on Snapchat, add me. But um, yeah, that is it for today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching. I love you so much and I will see you in tomorrow's vlog. I'm Chandler Alexis and I'm signing out. Good night, guys. A first kiss in the living room. That's a hella way to end the night. A hella way to end the night.